Ukufunda is an innovative program aimed at addressing inequalities and raising standards in South Africa's education system. It's about using the power of technology to make remote teaching and learning accessible to learners 24-7. It's not just about e-learning, it's about taking a, an holistic view of education. So what we're trying to do is take the characteristics of a good physical school and then replicate them in a virtual environment that is easily accessible by, by, by all. It also has a particular focus on teacher development where teachers could assess their ability in terms of content knowledge. So it, it, it creates this wonderful network where everybody could participate and create a virtual school environment which they can carry in their pocket. The Ukufunda Virtual School brings the classroom to mobile phones, putting learning into the hands of learners, teachers, parents and other educational stakeholders in South Africa and eventually other parts of the world. It also offers links to textbooks, counselling and emergency services and can be accessed on more than 8,000 mobile devices, including smartphones, tablets and low-end cell phones. It's data light, which makes it low-cost and affordable to users. And one mobile service provider in South Africa is considering offering a free service for Ukufunda users. So if you take the example of, of children's stories, it's very important for children to be read to even at a very young age. So the, even the first three years of a child's life, the more you read to that child, the better they perform academically later on in life. The problem you have, though, is a typical disadvantaged parent doesn't necessarily have access to a bookshelf of books. So what we do is we take that good content in the form of books and we make them accessible on the devices they do have, which are mobile phones. And so I'm holding in my hand a Nokia feature phone, a very low, low cost model to acquire, a low cost model to run, you only need to charge the battery once a week, but we're offering some pretty sophisticated services on this device. The cell phone sits in the hand and it brings learning right to the hand of the child. One of the interesting stories that I've heard is that children who live in areas where they don't have electricity and have to read with candles actually find it much easier to, to, to do their homework or to read texts of workbooks and, te and textbooks from their phone. So it's really a very powerful tool and that it brings learning to the hands of the learner. Mbuyiselo and Lovu grew up and went to school in a village in KwaZulu-Natal, where his mother sold cattle to make ends meet. In 2014, his village still has no electricity. But today, he's one of the leading developers of the Ukufunda program. In terms of accessing the information, it was very difficult for me while I was still at high school. It was very difficult because I had to attend evening classes. But now, since there is virtual school, I think it has a potential to make the difference, like huge difference in many lives. The famous saying is, it takes a village to raise a child, and we're trying to encapsulate that. And with the Ukufunda program, which will be launched at the beginning of 2015, it will now also take a virtual village to help raise and educate a child. Renée Dalcom, CCTV, Johannesburg.